This is a fragrance that received some hype years ago on YouTube, like way, way back when. I never really smelt it, and that's that's the way I am. Um, sometimes I just don't, um, I don't fall into a lot of hypes. Um, I don't buy a bottle just because it has been hyped. But, you know, better late than never. Let's try this one out. Let's see what I think about this one through a sample. Keep it tuned in. What's going on YouTube fragrance family? Welcome to my series of sampling samples. Today I'm gonna to be sampling from the House of Olfactive Studio their 2011 release called Still Life. And I think this is the hype train of this brand on YouTube uh, back back in the day. Um, so I wanna see which what this fragrance gives me. You know, I had stellar reviews back, back in the day. Um, and I believe this is the first time that I even talked about this brand. So let's get into the big notes. We got Yuzu, which uh, of course is a citrus that I absolutely love, pink pepper and rum. So those are the big notes, interesting notes. Let's get into my thoughts. So on my sample, what did I think? Well, the opening, beautiful whopping yuzu note that just comes crashing down onto your nose. What a beautiful note in a fragrance. I absolutely love when yuzu is in fragrances. Um, this citrus is met with the pink pepper almost right away, which is a great pairing in my personal opinion. Yes, the pink pepper might remind you of a lot of designer fragrances because of course, pink pepper is utilized quite a bit in a lot of designer fragrances these days. Um, and it might make you think that this is not worth niche money, but never judge too quickly. Now there's a knees in here and rum that come into play, warm up things a little bit in this fragrance, but they are potent and kind of leave the aromatic notes to themselves and beaming instead of taking over the scent. So overall, it left me feeling that it was a decent release, but nothing that made me feel like this one would stand out. Um, so for me, it was kind of lukewarm. Staying power, this is another thing that I didn't really like about this fragrance. It didn't jump off my skin. Um, I was only getting four to six hours as far as longevity, which is okay for a freshie, but I want more um, with low projection. Um, so that's not good either. Um, good and bad things about this fragrance. At the moment, I love the yuzu in this fragrance, but not much else. Um, everything else is, you know, it's a hyped fragrance and I was kind of, with hype fragrances, of course, I'm, I'm very much uh, cautious in regards to it. I don't want to fall into the hype. Um, I'm not quite sold yet. The low projection, the poor longevity hurts its score for me. Um, it's very much compared to Lumenis by Frappé, which is another hype scent that I'm really lukewarm on. Um, so it kind of makes sense to me if they're both compared because um, Lumenis I do own, um, but this one I do not. And that goes to pricing. This is $195 USD for 3.4 ounce bottle. It is Eau de Parfum Concentration. However, that is a fairly steep price to pay. Overall score from one to 10 bottles. I'm gonna give this one a little above average of a six bottles out of 10. And that goes to buy, try, or pass. This is more of a, another sample. So a try for me. Um, maybe I have to go back to it. I really think that Yuzu is redeeming. But if that's the only thing that's redeeming in this fragrance, for me personally, that's gonna be a, a pass altogether. I just don't think there's much else um, giving me that excitement in a fragrance. So this one, eh. <laughs> and that goes to all of you. Please comment below if you have smelt Still Life by the Olfactive Studio. Um, this is my first try of this brand. I wanted to go with the hype train. So if you have anything else from the brand that you think I should try, Always comment below, I love hearing that. And if you're, you know, you're completely on the other side of me and saying, Mark, this is a gem, um, tell me why you think it's so great. Um, I'd love to hear your take and maybe I'll take another chance at it and you never know, it might show up into one of my halls and with all, find a spot with all these beauties beside me. So thank you for watching, have a good one.